Hey there, welcome back to our channel guys. I'm Shahana and today we are going to discuss about DNA binding motifs and its dive. So as we all know, much of the gene regulation in bacteria and eukaryotes is accomplished by proteins that binds to DNA sequence and affect their expression which is basically turning genes off or on. So DNA binding motifs as the name suggests is a part of DNA binding protein which is specialized to recognize and bind to a region of DNA sequence. Oh you are asking what are motifs? Good question. Motifs are patterns of super secondary structures in proteins that is basically of alpha helices and beta sheets. That means you can consider DNA binding motif to be the hands of DNA binding protein which will recognize and hold on the DNA. And how this DNA binding motif binds to the DNA? Yep, they bind by physically attaching to DNA due to extensive complementary between the surface of protein and the surface features of DNA double helix in the region of the binding. Yeah, where they actually bind in the DNA? They can fit into the major groove. On the basis of some unique characteristics, these DNA binding motifs are categorized into different types such as helix turn helix motif, helix loop helix motif, leucine zipper motif, and gene finger motif. In this video, we are going to talk about helix turn helix motif only and in the next video, we'll discuss about the other types also. Helix turn helix motif is 20 amino acid in length, so it's just a small part of protein. It is found in both prokaryotes and eukaryotes and its main characteristic is that it has two alpha helices which is separated by a beta turn and this beta turn is made up of four amino acids. The first alpha helix has N terminal while the second alpha helix has C terminal. The C terminal alpha helix participates in sequence recognition and enable the protein to fit inside the major group of the DNA molecule. So it is called recognition helix. Homeodomain, it is an extended helix turn helix motif. It is found in proteins coded by homeotic genes. This is a highly conserved domain of 60 amino acid and its main characteristic is that it has three alpha helices. The second and third alpha helices are separated by beta turn. The third alpha helices is recognition helix because it recognizes and binds to the major group of DNA while the first helix make contact with the minor group. Thank you so much for watching this video guys. See you soon in the next video where we will continue this topic. Bye bye.